Talks to the Patriotic Coalition and PM designate Tihomir Oreshkovic are resuming talks today on forming the new government. The sides have yet to go public with the names of candidates for ministerial positions. However, as Friday's vote in Parliament on the new government approaches, they have said they will go public with the candidates on Thursday. Political parties in Parliament have agreed on the distribution of key committee seats in the chamber. The Patriotic Coalition and Most will have the chair of the Legislation Committee, and that post will go to Dražen Bošnjaković. They will also head the Committee on the Economy with Ivan Domagoj Milošević as chair, and the Health and Social Welfare Committee with Most's Ines Strenjalinić as chair. The Media, Finances, Foreign Relations and European Integration Committees and the Committee on the Constitution, Procedure and the Political System will also be headed by the parliamentary majority. Austria is considering whether to implement more border controls to stem the flow of migrants and refugees into the country. The government in Vienna has announced that Austria will have to change its policy towards migrants in 2016. Slovenia's Prime Minister Miro Cerar has already said that if Austria implemented a more stringent policy, his country would do the same on its border with Croatia. The first hearing in Tomislav Karamarko's lawsuit against communist-era secret police chief and former Croatian PM Josip Manolic, whom the HDZ leader has accused of defamation, was held today at the Zagreb District Court. The court has sent the case to a mediation council in the hopes of avoiding trial. However, an out-of-court settlement appears unlikely. Karamarko is suing over Manolic's statement in an interview published in the Weekly Nacional in which he said that Karamarko was an asset of the communist secret police in the 1980s. Karamarko is also suing Nacional. Today's forecast calls for at least partly to predominantly sunny skies in most of Croatia. There will be some moderate cloud cover on the central Adriatic in Lika and in interior Dalmatia. More clouds are expected by evening in the northern sections of the interior. On the coast, expect a light northwesterly wind with traces of a northeasterly along the very edges of the coast. The day's highs will range from 0 to 4 degrees inland and from 5 to 9 degrees on the coast. In the interior, it will remain mostly sunny until Friday with a chance of morning fog. On Saturday, expect heavier clouds with a chance of light snow in the north. Temperatures, especially in the morning, will still be quite cold, rising only slightly on Thursday and dipping again on Friday. Mostly sunny on the coast as we head toward the weekend. Northeasterly winds will pick up again tomorrow and continue into Friday, but they will not be as strong as last weekend. Temperatures will be slightly warmer Thursday, but will decline again on Friday.